Hey guys, Charles Reed. Um, I'm doing this speech extra credit thing. So that's what's going on here. Maybe it'll help some of you guys out too, though, for if you have speech anxiety or um, maybe it'll just kind of help you to see. It's easier just to act kind of calm about it. Just kind of try, try to have fun with it. That's what I do. So hello to my teacher who I shall... Um, I'm not going to be able to do my uh, main attention getter for this video because it's a video clip and I'm not uber tech savvy that I can get this in here. So instead, I'm going to just get, skip right to it. Anthony Padilla. Most of you, no wait, none of you have heard of Anthony Padilla or Smosh before. Well, I'll help you out by a little bit by telling you about it. Anthony Padilla created Smosh and it's a video network. They make funny videos all the time. They do skits, parodies. It's all for entertainment, and it's pretty great. I love it. It's currently the um, second most subscribed um, personal video, personal channel on YouTube. Now, I got into Smosh because... I got into videos, making videos and everything, because of Smosh. I watched it and I was like, oh my gosh, this is so funny. And I thought, you know what, I'm going to give this a try. People love to watch people just kind of hang out and stuff. And I, I enjoy it too, it's fun. And that's, I didn't even realize before this that vlogging was such a big thing. And they really got me into it. And I've seen so many Smosh videos, it is crazy. I'm like, I think I've seen every main channel Smosh video. It's pretty intense. Now Anthony does so much work with it. He built a huge empire out of this. There are magazines, everything. And it's funny. I mean, it's you watch these videos when you get home. They're hilarious. But it's just great. I mean, You'll see him doing just the most wacky, random stuff, and it's zany. I'll use some unique words here. It's zany. It's fun. I just love it. It makes you really think, and it makes you smile, which is really what you want to do, isn't it? I mean, you don't want to have to be thinking about serious stuff all the time, and, and having something that make, can make you smile really kind of lights up your day, I think. It's nice. And not only that, but it is, it has been the number one YouTube channel on several occasions. Just recently, um, until August 2013, it was too, for um, quite a few months, I believe, at least. It was at least on for six months. And so many people like the videos. Just from being up for an hour, you'll see like 1,400 likes immediately. And that's not even a tenth of the people that watch the videos. It's crazy. So many people love it, and it's just a fun way to go throughout your day, at least. Just watch this, um, a video for a clip for that's less than 10 minutes long, and it's just fun. And they do just more, more than just entertainment, too. Um, they give to charity. Often, I have seen um, these... For, I saw this article a little bit ago. And it was um, talking about how, the, for the food battle, it's, which is this video clip, um, they make these videos, and it's just pretty cool. They do, like, these food battles. It's kind of complicated to explain, so I'm not going to try to bore you with it too much. But uh, they're very long videos. Uh, they're pretty funny, though. And they all, 10% of the profits go to charity. Now, I think that's pretty cool. And they do a lot more charity stuff than that, too. Like, I remember in one of their earlier videos, they gave $10,000, which they won from a contest, to charity. Isn't that cool? And they do a lot more than that, too. They just don't like to publicize it. But I've seen, I've heard about a lot of charity stuff that they'd like to do. And I think that's nice. They really were part of the reason that I got into making it, and I just hope that I can 
entertain people. Kind of make someone's day brighter. So, just remember guys, always trust a man in a white van. Bye.